Welcome to 60 Second Civics, the daily podcast of the Center for Civic Education. I'm Mark Gage. Americans in the founding period generally agreed that certain natural rights existed, but they worried about how those rights could be protected. For John Locke and other natural rights philosophers, the great problem was to find a way to protect each person's natural rights so that everyone could enjoy them and live in peace with one another. Locke said that the best way to solve this problem is for each individual to agree with others and to create and live under a government and give that government the power to make and enforce laws. Locke called this kind of agreement a social contract. As in all contracts, to get something, you must give up something. In a social contract, everyone promises to give up the absolute right to do anything she or he wishes to do. In return, everyone receives the security that can be provided by a government. Each person consents to obey the limits placed upon her or him by the laws created by the government. Everyone gains the security of knowing that their rights to life, liberty, and property are protected. Government, then, is the better alternative to a state of nature, which would be imperfect because some people might not respect the rights of others. According to Locke, the main purpose of government is to protect those natural rights that the individual cannot effectively protect in a state of nature. That's all for today's podcast, 60 Second Civics, where civic education only takes a minute. (laughs) 